Ashdod today. Beautiful, breezy day. I hope the breeze doesn't bother the sound. And we're in Ashdod. I'm on the way to the beach. You'll see my swimming suit pretty soon. But on the way, I saw these two amazing memorials here in Ashdod. If you look over in this direction, you can see a sinking boat. That boat is called the Struma. The Struma, during World War II, was on its way to Israel with 789 people, including passengers and crew. It got to Tur the, the, the coast of Turkey in the Mediterranean, and it had engine problems. In order to go to the dock to be fixed, the Turks wanted to make sure the British were going to allow them into Palestine, into Eretz Israel. The British said no, the Turks didn't allow them to dock, and they were sitting out there with a dead engine in the sea when the boat was torpedoed. All the passengers were killed, and all the crew except for one, who ended up being saved by on a floating piece of the ship, got saved. That was the Struma during World War II, and that showed that there could be no Aliyah bet. But after Israel became a state, there was still Aliyah bet. This time, it wasn't secretly, clandestinely coming to Israel, it was clandestinely leaving their countries. The Moroccans wouldn't let the Jews leave. And in 1961, while they were doing this, this escape from Morocco, there was a boat called the Egoz. And the Egoz went to sea with 44 passengers, Jews coming from Morocco to Israel, all of them sneaking out. And on January 10th, 1961, the boat disappeared, never to be heard from again. Of all the, all, four, all the 44 people on board, totally disappeared. And this memorial, you can see the people making Aliyah and finally getting to Eretz Israel. And you can see that the shape is almost like a sail, if it was a boat, or the tail of a plane. And it says in the middle that they came to Israel by Yam, by Vir, by Yabasha by sea, by air, and on dry land. And it also has the name of the boat that it goes in the middle. So here we have it, guys. The city of Ashdod getting bigger all the time. A wonderful beach town and some of the most amazing beaches in the country. Yet, on your way there, you see the memorial to those who tried to get to the country.